I'm Andrew Boyce. Uh, I'm a postdoctoral fellow at the Hotchkiss Brain Institute at the University of Calgary. Um, and yeah, so I just started my postdoctoral fellowship. Uh, most of my training is in molecular biology and a little bit of live cell imaging with confocal microscopy. The plan is for my project as a postdoctoral fellow is to uh, take on some two photon combined with electrophysiology. So I came to sort of uh, see what the latest and greatest is and with that technology. I think it's a great opportunity to uh, learn from physicists, chemists, biologists uh, and actually see the techniques in action. Um, it's also a really good chance to meet people from all over the place doing um, all types of different things and see how their, uh, the technology is applied in, in different scenarios and different diseases, uh, tissues, that kind of thing. Oh, I think it's uh, incredibly helpful. This has been one of the best, most rewarding experiences so far that I've uh, had in my career. I think um, for me personally, this course, I've seen a lot of um, interesting um, builds of, of technology. So how to put together a two-photon microscope um, or really any microscope, uh, as well as I'm seeing a wide array of uh, technologies and um, it's helping me think about ways that I can apply them to my project and projects in the future. I used Scientifica a two photon microscope when we were doing uh, zebrafish uh, imaging, um, uh, which is nice because it's actually a chance to see uh, that system for the first time. Um, and because at this point we um, are using mostly uh, micro manipulators and more the electrophysiological side of uh, the scientific equipment, so seeing the imaging equipment is really nice. I thought it was great. Yeah, it. Uh, uh, we were imaging um, almost the or we were imaging the protectum of the zebrafish larvae, and it was really fast. We were able to see. Uh, the calcium responses that we wanted to see and uh, so yeah I think it was a really nice system. Absolutely. Uh, I mean we're halfway through and it's already w far and away above uh, the expectations that I had and I had pretty high expectations so.